Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Um, in today's video, I'm going to show you everything that happens in my day here in Mumbai. So, I'm going to vlog for my entire day today and show you, give you a glimpse of my life here in Bombay. So today's plan is, I have college but the good thing is today in college I just have one class that I have to attend, so which is good and also the class is at 10.45 so I had quite a lot of time for myself in the morning. But also today we have to wear sari for college, uh, we all just decided that today we'll wear sari because we've been learning like different types of drapes. So, we are uh, we all are going to wear different types of sari so basically i took tribal um sari from orissa because my sari is from orissa with the kanak wheel uh, palla so yeah so let's just start because it's nine right now and i have to leave by 10 because my class is at 10 45 let's go before doing anything i like to just clean my room so i'm just gonna fold my laundry that I did the last night that pajama is still gila so I'm going to let it dry I'll come back and put it back so now let's fold them and put it in the almari without like making my bed I find it very messy whenever I come back like like a bed sheet so I see what I wear and if my comforter is all like khula hua, something goes wrong with me then so and personally it's very strange that my bed is not made and I come back from uh, college so I always make my bed before leaving now let's get ready So the drape that I decided to do was a kota pad drape. I'm not too sure if I'm pronouncing it right, but I saw the tutorial on this YouTube channel called Border and Fall. So just looking at the video, I'm trying to rape it. It took a lot of time for me to just figure out how she was doing it because the video was just too fast for me to figure out the whole steps. But I tried my best to copy it after quite a lot of failed attempts and frustration. <laughs> So a lot of tribal people they used to drape their saris in a way keep pleats back side pair not in the front that way like you have uh, you don't really have to worry about like lifting the pleats up whenever you're walking it's just more convenient that way so they used to pleat put pleats in the back and now i'm just trying to figure out how to do the pallu And also like tribal people they don't really uh, wear blouses so the reason why I chose this crop top instead of a proper blouse is because I didn't want uh, my blouse or any kapra uh, basically my top or my blouse to show when the whole sari is draped um, so yeah that's why I decided to wear this crop top you'll see it in the end ki kaisa look aata hai and it, it basically it legit looks like uh, I'm not really wearing a blouse so finally I figured out how to do the palla 
um also the sari ka material is quite clingy so draping it in a normal sari way is in way difficult so draping it like this so as kind of tricky so right now i've just draped it like this um i'll make the pallu when i get back to college because pallu bahut funny lag raha hai abhi raste mein jaane ke liye yeah this is what shut down today Let's go. Breakfast. Let's go. For a change today, I'm going to order. It was also my friend's birthday that day, so we decided to get a cake for her and just do a mini celebration. It was so much fun seeing everyone all dressed up in sari. It was so fun. I have to say this was such a comfortable drape and I did get a lot of stairs but it was all worth it. Mm-hmm.